uh okay looks like we got i think i, I got cut off there recording whatever we got dochi is she like changing her name from i am dochi to dochi i mean it, it is simpler but i like the i am dochi anyways crazy it turns out this only came out like two days ago uh i only know the one song spooky coochie and that shit went hard and the video was really cool as well uh yeah let's check it out Um, wait, 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 wait. Am I allowed to even show this? Like, I mean, it's on YouTube with her channel. So, like, would I not... Would I... Would I... Am I allowed to do this? Am I going to get in trouble? Bro, this is... What the fuck is going on? Wait, 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 I'm confused. I guess you could say ballin' for football, but when someone says ballin' like whatever, I always think of basketball, because like, no one says, you know, you ballin' in football, man, he's ball. yeah, you don't, you don't say that. But like, I don't know, when, when someone says ballin' like a person, I always assume basketball, because it just makes more sense. But she's obviously referencing Tom Brady, because you know, there's no other like Brady um players in the NBA, I don't think, right? I don't think so. I know Mick Grady, but that dude's... um. What the fuck was his name? Something McGreedy. That, that dude's old. He's he's retired. Long hair this wavy. I mean, my hair's getting long, but I don't think it's wavy. She's talking about me. <laughs> um, all right, let's keep going. I just thought that was cool that she name dropped me, even though it's not about me at all. Yo, this video is so like, like, I, am I allowed to show all of this? This, I feel like this is really inappropriate. <laughs> um, obviously it's blurred out and stuff, but like, it's 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 you can you don't need like it's your imagination can fill in the rest. It's it's really um, I don't know if this is allowed. Yo, what she's dude, this course is. I don't know how I feel about this because it's 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 so wild and all over the place, and it's just like super loud. Uh, what she say? None of these hating ass bitches gonna phase me. Did she say something about Jay Z? No, she didn't. I guess I'm hearing things. Bro, this this was cool. Then I ball like Spalding because it's the the brand of uh, that basketball. You know, like I'm pretty sure the NBA uses Spalding basketballs. Uh, they're a brand that creates basketballs. Call my bluff when that shit is my calling. Yo, I like that. I like that. Um, won't that bitch? I'm all in. It's a brand new day, new pace, light jogging, dude. Her her her. Um, what would that be? The rhyme schemes, I guess. Well placed. I like I like the rhyme schemes. Mm, straight facts no jargon it's not it's jargon but the way she said it jargon to to make the rhyme it's a slant rhyme but i like that jargon you know it's just uh get to the point you know you want the facts you want the facts it's a whole lot of blue checks no login i wonder like, i don't know what this means blue checks i know blue checks like on twitter or whatever because you're verified and login is referring to like a, a social platform right where you're verified on it but a whole lot of blue, big blue checks. Are, 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 I never received the check before. Actually, I'd have, but they're white. But maybe you know, like bigger people's checks are blue. Am I am I missing the double entendre here? You know what this is remind me of in a way? Uh, the music videos remind me of Kanye's music video. Um. It was one of the songs from The Life of Pablo, and it was really weird because I remember the internet blew up over it because like it was naked celebrities laying in the bed together. It's like what like the it was just like a big ass bed, and there was naked celebrities in it. Like I remember Donald Trump was in it, his his wife was in it, um, Taylor Swift was in it, I think Rihanna was in it, Kim was in it, 
Kanye was in it. Just, it was just a bunch of these celebrities, and they were all like naked and shit. And it just still really weird to think about, like, how the fuck did they do that? Was that like deep fakes where they they put the fake face on? Because like I feel like that wasn't very common back then. I don't know. That shit was really weird, and that's what it's reminded me of. Because it's just like a bunch of naked people <laughs> on YouTube, and it kind of creates like a shock value because it's YouTube. You know, it's not Pornhub. You're not here to see naked people. It's it's really out of its element. But then again, you know, it creates a talking point for the video. Ouch. Now I'm also getting vibes from 6ix9ine, Takashi 6ix9ine. I've only like heard his songs. I've never actually went to Spotify and searched up his music to listen to it. I've never done that. I've only heard it through like videos on YouTube or whatever, just TikTok memes and stuff. You know, I've. I've heard his music and this kind of sounds like his music in a sense it's really loud and it's just yelling um like I was gonna say xxx tentation but his yelling is it's not like this his yelling is different his screaming and stuff and his certain well he doesn't do it in every song but some of the songs that he does it in, it's different and then you got Takashi 6 9 where it's like the screaming just to, to scream and that's what this sounds like I, I don't know man I don't know how I feel about this <laughs> Guns everywhere. Just don't she live that lifestyle? I'll ask that again. I look like the one girl from Orange is the New Black. What is this? There's gotta be some symbolism behind this video, right? There's gotta be some kind of symbolism behind this. And what is it? You know what? I'm gonna look on Rap Genius real quick. Uh, and it's too new, I guess, to have any answers. Beat switch. Whoa, that text. There's definitely some kind of meaning behind this video that I don't understand. Something with violence. Yo, this text here, what was this text? Dochi, it's her name all over the place. I like the way it's laid out. I, I don't know why, but that looks super cool. Um, yeah, okay. I don't know how I feel about this track. I, I, oops, I loved, um, that's a dope track. I loved, um, Spooky Coochie. That shit was dope. But this track, I'm not loving it so much, man. The verses are really short. And I don't know, man. Uh, bitch offshore like Mexico. Um, straight to the point like a decimal. We've heard that a thousand, a million times in rap. Everyone's used that. Um, coconuts, da 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 da, boco bucks, pay me. I don't know, man. This one, this one's not, I don't know. I don't fuck with this one. This one, I'm gonna give it a trash. Don't get upset and butthurt. It's my opinion. A trash is anything lower than an 8.0. So I'm gonna give this a solid 6.5. It's not that bad. The beat is nice. The beat was definitely uh, tough. It had the pop, pop, pop. You know, it was a kind of an aggressive beat. I guess it kind of makes sense because with the, the vocals, it was very aggressive. I don't know, man. I just don't like the, the yelling and shit. The yelling and the screaming, like, it's just... I'm not a fan of that, dude. It, it's tough to like that. It, it, like, maybe if you're working out, then you want that kind of music. Because I see a lot of people say that Takashi 6 9 they always great for working out, too. Because he's always just he's screaming, and it's all hype music. And that's kind of what this is like. I, don't even, I wouldn't even call that really hype. Like, I don't even know. Like, I, just, I don't know. I don't know, man. I'm a little bit upset with this because I, I really liked the, the one song I heard from her. But I guess, you know, not every song can be a banger from everyone. Um, 
So yeah, six point. Did I say a six point five? I think I said six point five. Yeah. Sorry, y'all, but this one, this one ain't it for me.